So I just got done doing my one hour of Khmer. And um, this is Mpai Prambon. And this is almost the same symbol as this one, Ru. But you see, Ru doesn't have this kind of flare at the top, whereas Vu does. So I thought, Vu, what's, what's like flare? Voluptuous curve. So, Mpai Prambon, Vu. And then, of course, to link this all back to, in my mind, in a complete circle, then 29 goes to 30 where I started. So he Su Han Sok Hang. And that's us as like a little family. And so then my mind can switch over, switch over to think So he Su Han Sok Hang again. And, um, of course, the English word um, for... Um, I can't think of the right way to put this. Uh, it's obvious to me now that I'm learning another language, lots of little nuances in the English language I didn't really know before, like dove stands for peace, so love stands for peace. Super obvious to me now, like it jumps, there's a lot of little things in English that are just totally jumping out at me like, oh, that's obvious, oh, that's obvious. I've, I've seen that for 20, 30 years. I never, I never put that together quite like that, even though... As a scientist, it's my job to be an expert and a professional at being able to memorize more than the average person and link it all together in my mind. And it's literally being a scientist, it's a job requirement to put in excessive amounts of thought before you do anything. That way you're constantly obsessing about the consequences of every little action you do or don't do. So, did my one hour of Gamera.